common presentations you see when you are on a webinar. This is a very simple PowerPoint presentation. You're looking here, my PowerPoint uh, program is open to a, uh, you know, just a very, very simple presentation here, how to choose a webinar provider. Um, in PowerPoint, you have a chance to create a series of slides. The slides can contain uh, text and images. And one of the neat things also is that you can make notes for yourself uh, at the bottom to, to help cue yourself when you are conducting a, um, a presentation. You can actually create an entire presentation and then print this out with the notes for yourself uh, and, and have, have a handout for yourself so you can work with that. Um, the other thing that you can do is to build in some animations uh, that keep this live alive and, uh, and let you move from one topic to the other uh, using what's called an animation here. Let me show you what that looks like if I, if I bring this slide up for um, right from here. So if I have the slide and I'm having a discussion, uh, initially what you see is the picture. If I advance the slide by one click, I, I have the first bullet point. It, this and this one, it, it's about online collaboration. When I'm finished with that particular subject and I want to move that on, I just click and I just move ahead one step at a time and I can do that on as many of those slides as I like. Um, what I find interesting uh, in, in recent days here is that um, I've been attending some real estate seminars where the real estate presenters have actually been presenting in this in this mode right here, which is your your uh, your working mode. Uh, a lot of people don't really understand how to work with PowerPoint, but you know what? It still works. Um, they they still get their point across. I uh, I'm not finding fault. I just think that it's interesting that uh, that people do that. So you know, PowerPoint it does not have to be difficult. Uh, you can use lots of great tools. To, you know, just take it slow, take it easy. If this is something new for you, don't let it stop you from from getting started. Uh, just just work work with it. Uh, you can get in you know a whole bunch of of templates and designs for your PowerPoints. You can customize these with your own logos with your company name and as I say you can actually create handouts if I want to create a handout from this what I will do is go up to the top I will hit publish and then I can cr actually create handouts in Microsoft Word I can select any of these uh, formats here this is one of my favorites I have to put the note below the slides uh, and in that particular mode the slide appears at the top of the page and the notes appear below that. Um, since they appear in Microsoft Word, you can go back, you can edit those, you can do whatever you like. The, uh, the, the, the notes that appear below are the notes that appear down here, and then you can add additional um, notes in your, in your Microsoft Word document. It's very, very cool and, and a neat way to go.